here it is my transformed decluttered and organized loft i cannot tell you how happy this makes me on two counts one because i have a decluttered and organized loft and two because it means that my rooms of doom course is this close from being finished I now need to just edit up the video where I show all the transformed rooms of doom and I've got one other lecture to finish editing which won't take me very long and then I can submit it to Udemy for approval which is the really scary bit because they might decide that something needs changing and if they decide that something needs changing in the lecture that I made before I decluttered the loft I can't really do it so um, cross your fingers for me. Um, so let me show you around my decluttered and organised loft. You'll remember these shelves from before. Quite a bit went from off here, where you can see these two are complete. Oh, there's a little bit on here now, but this one's completely empty. Um, I've got rid of that cable. It turned out to be a TV aerial cable, a really long TV aerial cable. I haven't had TV for over 20 years, so that went. Uh, there was a telephone, which I used to keep, like a basic telephone. I used to keep that to test my line if I had any problems, so I could could be sure that it wasn't my, te my telephone equipment that was causing the problems but I haven't had a landline for about 12 years so I got rid of that too. Oh no I did have a landline but I got rid of it about five years ago. Um, what else went? Oh I found some, some glasses, spectacles here which I thought I'd got rid of years ago so they went. I found those bits for my fridge but I was really pleased to find and got them back into use. Uh, oh, a few other things went from on here. I found some things but I have absolutely no idea what they are. This is some elastic with some fixings. It looks terribly official, but I don't know what it is. So this says, what is this for? 9th of September, 2020. Um, that's the 9th, oh yeah, 9th of September. Anyway, so that next time I find this, I can say, well, if I still haven't identified what this is for in like, I don't know, the next time I do this lock, which will probably be three and a half years time, because that's when it will come around on my decluttering schedule, then I will be getting rid of it. And similarly, this is, there's a funny little sort of syringy thing in there and some fixings. It might be to do with the um, turntable that I got rid of. I don't know. So again, what is this for? 9th of September 2020. And if I don't know in a few years time, that can go as well. Uh, what else can we see in this aspect? I tidied up the cardboard over here. I also found my sewing machine in the back there with bits of brickwork that are all chipping off here falling into the box and probably damaging the machine. So I had to take it downstairs, vacuum it all out, and now lives over there. It's not going back in that corner. Um, I don't know what else you can see on this angle. I might turn the camera around now. While I'm doing that, you could uh, take the opportunity to give me a like. That's always very welcome. Let's see what you can see How about that. Yep, so this side doesn't look so very much different over here, but I did actually get rid of a fair bit. Oh, is that wonky? I'm just going to straighten it up. I don't know how easily I can straighten it up. It might have to be a bit wonky. Oh, there you go. That's better. Um, so I did get rid of some paints. There were a few paints. You can see my softbox here lighting me up. Um, yeah, I got rid of some paints that have gone dry. I moved the big bags of plastic, which I can't get rid of until I've got more of them, uh, under there, so a bit more out of the way. Under there are the boxes of things that I'm storing for my friend and actually just really by coincidence she said to me this week that or last week that she wants to pick them up so they're going to go so that's great um, and then I'm actually going to hold the camera so you can see the last bit. This is kind of where the majority of stuff still is but it's much tidier so what I've got here is my suitcases and then this section is a little bit of IT equipment and also boxes for big ticket items that are still in warranty um, and then that's the water tank, which I'm hoping the plumber will either plumb in or get rid of. And at the very back there are some just kind of spare boxes, which I don't need very often and probably got too many of them. But since I've got space to store them, I'm not going to worry about it. So there you go. That's my transformed loft, which I'm extremely pleased with. So, yes, please do give me a like and watch out because fingers crossed the course is coming soon. See you next week. Bye.